Okay, you, okay, you sure you'd be able to hear me <clears throat> pretty well? I wrote a new book called New Girl, a Dante X Reader, which is from Afmal. And if you type in YouTube, Afmal should pop up. This is in. Um, the it's a since it's a reader I'm gonna be using the name Anna. <sighs> another year, another school. Stupid parents moving every year. I mentally grumbled to myself as I pulled out of the driveway. I love my parents, but I'm gonna move out of their household this year because I can't up and move every year. Uh, oh, hi. Uh, I'm Anna Smith. My parents are traveling scientists, so whenever an exciting, more interesting job pops up, we, uh, now they, move. I like this part of Rouen, so I'm moving to, f I'm moving out to finally grow some roots and f find an actual home, not just a living space. Time to unpack in my dorm. I walk up to the junior dorms and check the schedule of the school I'd sent my parents to print out. So, room 203? Okay. I walked up the stairs until I saw a door labeled 150 through 230. More walking? Why me? <laughs> I mentally whined as I started counting. They laid it odds on one side, evens the other. Should make it easier. I ran to the end of the hall, beginning to backtrack till I hit my door. 211, 209, 207, 205, and 203. Finally! I mentally celebrated that I made it and knocked on the door. Hello? I asked confidently through the door. I believe I'm your roommate. I have a key, so I'm coming in. I unlocked the door and walked in. Lawrence? W what are you doing here? One of my best guy friends turned around wearing an expression similar to mine when he heard my voice. He's... Annie? What are you doing here? He fired back. Hey, I asked you first, mister. I managed to giggle out. No way, I thought I'd never see you again after I left Nutelli Middle. You must have changed your number or something because the one from middle school is no longer in service. He smiled sheepishly. He, yeah, that's because Kawhi Chan got to it. Who is? Kawhi Chan's a friend from high school. I say friend, but she's a friend of a friend. I wonder if... You'll meet her later. N no, I'm not reading your mind. I just remember how you think. I did panda as, as he read my thoughts. I like, I like fairy tale. I'm officially scared of Lawrence now. A a anyway, how's Garth, Travis, and Cadenza? Cadenza had always used me as a personal mannequin by bribing me with money, food, etc. I blinked on his answer as I looked at how he described it a little, uh, how he decorated it a little flat. As I stared, I saw a picture of him, Garth, in a blue-headed, blue-eyed guy I didn't know. Who's that? I blurted, cutting him off mid-sentence while pointing to the picture of the three in their school uniforms. You obviously weren't listening, but that's Dante. Why do you ask? Do you already have a college crush? He teased while poking my arm. I blushed a little, but quickly shook it. I don't even know the guy. How can I wait? You said his name was Dante? Lawrence nodded, scared but intrigued. I know, I saw him a few times my parents went to Phoenix Drop to get supplies and dragged me along. He would sit on the curb outside his house on the edge of town and wave at me whenever I was dragged along. I doubt he'll remember me, though. That was like when we were six or seven. No way he remembers me. Lawrence just laughed heavily. <laughs> you don't know just how vividly he remembers things. Lawrence mumbled at such a volume I didn't hear him. I bugged him to tell me what he said, but he just shrugged me off. Darn it! Time for my first class. Gotta go. And he ran out the door with no shoes on, so I just threw them down the hall at him, making his legs buckle miraculously. Thank you! He yelled down the hall. Now it's time to unpack my stuff. I bet half of it I won't even need. That's all I basically have right now. And if you keep hearing static, that's because my hand keeps bumping my new mic. I'm used to being able to just rubbing my face while I record.
Let me turn up my brightness on my laptop so you can see my face. Oh, other way. Hey. New mic, new headset, yay. Audio should be better. Um, I'm going to show you the cover. Hold up, no, the cover's going to be the thumbnail. <laughs> um, oh, if you want to know why I'm, like, delirious... Yeah, I can't sleep, and it's summer break for me. Amazing. <laughs> uh, I'm going to post this in Crash. Bye-bye. Tell me if you liked it or not, or if you liked the idea.